going on guys Julian from memory cards here and today very excited to take a look at the new Akira 35th anniversary box set which includes all of the volumes of the manga this is a really cool product and might be a must own for Akira fans so let's take a look at it okay so you might see some random stuff in the background stuff everywhere it's the holidays We've got boxes and presents and all kinds of stuff cats running around but here is what we are looking at today this is the Akira 35th anniversary box set this thing is massive it weighs a lot and you'll see why in a second uh, but man is this thing cool so you can see that this retails for $199.99 I got this on Amazon for pretty much half off. I think I paid $90 with Prime shipping. Uh, so two days was the shipping time. Ordered this on Monday and I got it on Wednesday. Uh, when I saw that this was selling for half of that price and being the Akira fan that I am, I pretty much had to get this. I really like the box design itself and this is obviously something you're gonna wanna keep instead of just taking the contents out and throwing this box out. Obviously, you want to keep this box. It is the box set, but you get the big Akira bold letters across the top. Looks super pretty, super clean. The red just pops on this. It looks so, so nice. Of course, red is like a dominant color in the Akira series, obviously. Okay, let's open this thing up. All right, opening this thing itself is a treat in its own right. We're going to do that right now. This just pops open each side. Comes with the good for health, bad for education patch. That is super nice. I actually already have one of these, but having an extra one is cool. And here is the meat of the 35th anniversary box set. You get all six volumes of the manga and the Akira Club art book. These are all hardcover, which is why this box weighs so much. You got the great popping pastel colors. They look just gorgeous. Cool shade of green, pastel -y purple and pink. Very, very cool. Even the red is, is a lighter red compared to the very bold red traditionally seen you see here. So let's, uh, let's grab the first one here. One of the cool things about this set is that it is now in the traditional read from right to left format. You, know, you read the Japanese kanji uh, from right to left as opposed to English lettering you read from left to right, which is why you read manga from the back. You know, a lot of new US readers who would pick up a manga might jump to what they assume is the front of the book. It's actually the back. So. Um, and for comparison, we'll bring out, this is what I had previously owned, which is the soft cover uh, format of the, of the of volume one. And it is in the left to right format where you do read traditionally, you know, like you would a comic book uh, from left to right. So ding, 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 ding. Uh, that is not the case. In the hardcover version, in the hardcover version, you're going to be reading from right to left. And uh, this is also a, a different translation from what I, I was reading um, that um, Otomo might have retranslated this, or there was a team that retranslated some of it uh, to fit more like the original language. I haven't done like full comparisons. I just have looked at this first volume and on the box itself, there was a, uh, when this was shrink wrapped, it also came with a uh, card that told you everything this box came with. And it mentioned there that this was retranslated. But for anyone who has just seen the Akira movie and enjoys it and maybe wants to read the manga, which contains a lot more stuff than the movie. The movie's obviously a little under two hours long, I think. And 
the manga is uh, going to take you a lot longer than just that two hours to read um, and contain a lot more content than the movie, obviously. The movie is an abridged version of the Akira story. Okay, so let's take a look at the Akira Club art book, which is really, really nice. It's got this cutout, the Akira Club logo, or the Akira Club design here. The memory of Akira lives on in our hearts. Really good uh, coffee table book here, for sure. Gorgeous artwork. This is so cool. Kaneda on his bike. Got Tetsuo. So yeah, this is what you are getting with the Akira 35th anniversary box set. Um, this is a fantastic deal, especially for those who maybe have not been able to finish the manga series, maybe only own one, the first volume and the first two. This is a fantastic deal for you. These alone, this is volume one, as I showed earlier, this alone costs 25 US dollars. So to get all six, it's gonna that already alone is more than what this is selling for with its sale price being said. Um, these might have sold out on Amazon, but you might be able to still get it. This is really, really great. I can't say enough good things about it. Uh, it just looks so cool. And if you're a big fan of Akira, this is something that will fit in your collection. It's kind of unwieldy. I mean, it's a, it's a large box, it weighs a lot. Uh, display is kind of limited. I mean, your options are to take these out, which is what I'll probably do, is I'll probably take these out individually and display them on a bookshelf, because that is gonna look great. And then I'll, I'll just put the box on top of the shelf or <clears throat> put the box somewhere. Obviously, I can't fit it right here with uh, this shelf, which has some dunnies on it, uh, some different vinyl figures, and then of course, the Akira movie set that I have. Not sold as a set, obviously, but I got the original VHS, the special edition of the DVD, kind of dusty. Haven't dusted that in a minute. And then the Blu-ray 25th anniversary. So this already came out 10 years ago. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel for more content. Be doing more stuff like this, anime related, manga related in the future probably. Kind of focused on video games right now, but we're gonna be all over the place. Today is the last day to sign up for the giveaway we're doing, which ends on Friday, December 22nd. Today is Thursday, the 21st. Entering that giveaway gives you the chance to win one of three gift cards to your choice of either the eShop, the PlayStation Network points, whatever they're called, and a Microsoft card. So 20 bucks to one of the three consoles you get to pick. We're gonna have three winners from that. So three cards in total, three different winners. See the link in the description for details on how to enter the giveaway.